discover the inspiring journey of Jamie Foxx as he apologizes for his Instagram post. The actor Jamie Foxx has apologized after a social media post from him drew accusations of anti-Semitism. Foxx's post, on Instagram, read, They killed this dude named Jesus, what do you think they'll do to you? Hashtag fake friends hashtag fake love. But the 55-year-old entertainer deleted the post after fellow users asserted that it echoed the hateful belief that Jewish people all together as one crucified and killed Jesus Christ. That idea has been used to justify violence against Jews for centuries, such as during the Holocaust, when 6 million were murdered in Europe by the Nazis. A major document signed by the worldwide Roman Catholic Church's leadership during the Second Vatican Council in 1965 officially condemned the idea that Jews were collectively guilty for Christ's killing. And on Saturday, Fox published a new Instagram post which contained a mea culpa from the actor. I want to apologize to the Jewish community and everyone who was offended by my post, Fox's statement said. I now know my choice of words, has, caused offense and I'm sorry. That was never my intent. To clarify, I was betrayed by a fake friend and that's what I meant with they not anything more. Fox's apology concluded with an expression of love and support for everyone, including the Jewish community, along with another offering of deepest apologies. Meanwhile, Fox wasn't the only actor to be ensnared by his Instagram controversy. Jennifer Aniston appeared to have clicked the platform's like button under Fox's deleted They Killed This Dude Named Jesus post, and she has since released her own statement condemning anti-Semitism. This really makes me sick, said Aniston's statement, which was posted on Instagram stories. I did not like this post on purpose or by accident. And more importantly, I want to be clear to my and anyone hurt by the showing up in their feeds, I do not support anti-Semitism and I truly don't tolerate hate of any kind. Period. Fox's handling of the episode did earn him numerous supportive comments. Alongside the actor's apology Saturday, music producer Brian Prescott wrote, Anyone that has been around you knows that you have no hate for anyone. You're the best. Don't let anyone make you think differently. The actor Portia Coleman added, People can't even speak anymore without someone being offended. You are clearly talking about someone you thought was a friend who turned out to be a backstabber. Society is so sensitive these days.